Hello everyone. Now you may have seen me do a sort of an updated um, little clip sort of video or slightly talky with photographs video like this before. Yes that was on another um, video about um, Henrietta, not Henrietta, Harriet and that. Now as you can see from the title and the fact that this is tagged on to my um, St. Um, Botany Church and that yes I'm wanting to just slightly update you on Sir Charles um, Gayton Darwin and that because like her I'd found out some other little bits of information that I thought you'd want to know and that yeah the main thing is and without giving it away because the one thing I hate to do is spoil future videos but this is kind of almost tagged between this video where Charles and his wife memorial plaque is and another video that I have got coming up um, in the future that's another Darwin video that's related but all I'm going to say is um, if anyone knows their history about the Darwins starting of course with Charles Darwin who is like the head of the family kind of thing Charles Darwin actually went to university and then later became, you know, old Darwin, you know, that used to teach, um, I say teach, you know what I mean, he was heavily involved in the actual um, college that he was associated with in Cambridge, which was Christ College, Cambridge. And I've only just discovered that Charles, who in context is um, Charles Darwin's grandson, he's... Um, the son of um, George Darwin and Maud Darwin and of course sister to Gwen um, R-A-V-E-R-A-T you've seen my previous videos probably on her for example and that yeah so just thought I would do a little bit of reading to help update you on this um, yes he was a scientist a um, <sighs> apologies guys i'm struggling to read this i should know this it's the type but it's the type of scientist that he was um uh p h y s i c i s t yes as we know he was the grandson of sir charles darwin master of Christ College, Cambridge, that's the reason why I wanted to read this to you, became director of the National um, CHYSIS and that, laboratories in 1938. During World War II, he was part of the British scientific working in America and was connected with the Manhattan Project. Hmm. That shows his credibility, doesn't it? That's for sure. Later, was a pioneer in the computer industry in the UK. Hmm. <laughs> oh, here's a laugh. Wouldn't that be fun if um if anyone had seen my Alan Turing video of the added connections with him at all? After all, he was definitely one of the pioneers of the earliest computers in this country. That's for sure. So yeah, that's my point. I wanted to tag that on along with after his burial of course but like I've just said I've got a future video all I will say is it's involving Charles Darwin and his college but I thought you'd also like to know the fact that it wasn't just him who is associated with Christ College Cambridge it was also later on his grandson Charles Gayton Darwin so thank you very much guys <laughs>